All eyes are on Washington tonight, with the president just hours away from giving his State of the Union address. A week later than he was originally supposed to because of the government shutdown. Now, we talked with lawmakers from Kansas to find out what they're expecting to hear from the president tonight. KSNT News Capitol Bureau reporter Hannah Brandt explains. Going into tonight's State of the Union speech, the president's push for a border wall stands front and center. We spoke to federal lawmakers from Kansas, some who say they want the wall too. I absolutely support the wall or border security in any number of ways. Well, we do need a border wall. I've been to the border. There's a crisis there. I know a crisis when I see it. And the first step of solving the problem is building some type of a wall. Leading up to the speech, the president has hinted that he may go over Congress and declare a national state of emergency to get money for the border wall. Listen, I support the president. Um, I would rather, I, I like seeing legislation that can pass the House, the Senate, and be signed by the president. But I, I support the president's desire to keep our country safe. But Republican leaders say if he does decide to wait for a solution from Congress, it's on Democrats. I sure hope that Ms. Pelosi finally comes to the table and negotiates in good faith. So far, she's offered no solution of her own. The Republicans have uh, come forward to negotiate in, in full faith and, uh, and transparency. And I'd like to see the same from the Dems. Others are just hoping for both parties to reach a compromise. It doesn't make any sense to me for everyone, both, both sides, to say this is our position, uh, knowing that if a bill is going to become law, it has to pass the House of Representatives and it has to be signed by the president. There has to be some give and take. Our Hannah Brandt reporting there will keep you updated on what comes out of that speech.